Welcome to Upgrade. I'm your host, Frank the Tank, and today I'm going to bring you something that I've been doing for quite a while. I have, I own these three wireless um, earbud sets, and I'm going to tell you these are the top three choices overall 2018. So I'm going to get into it and give you some details exactly why I choose these models and why I own them, you know, because first of all, we're going to start from the cheapest one to the best one uh, to the better one I guess you know we're gonna go from the lowest to the highest one and why I choose which I choose to be, be the best one of all three if you're gonna purchase one of the earbuds one of the wireless earbuds I highly recommend you watching this whole through and maybe I could help you out with some of the choices uh, personally I've been using them for quite a while and I've been happy with some of them and I've been and I've been super excited about the other one. So let's start out with the pick of the litter, number three. All right, we're going to pick number three first. We're going to move these out of the way. This one, too. Actually, we're going to pick Sony. I start out with Sony because um, it's one of those things that I thought it was going to be good off the bat because it had the noise cancellation. But it is one of the worst ones from all of them so first of all you do need to download an application to sync up and, and make sure you could mess around with the equalizer the bass and all that stuff but that's not what i i picked at the land because um lag so i'm watching youtube videos on my phone or on my ipad there's a big delay on this i mean it sounded like I'm looking at these old Chinese movies where they start talking first and you can see, you can hear the, the audio after. Same thing here, what you're going to get. Top number two, why I didn't pick up uh, to put it in higher places because the way this box is it's set up. I don't know who the hell created this, but it was the worst, I mean the worst um, setup I ever seen. I mean, overall, it's one of the ugliest ones. First of all, it's a big, bulky, ugly, men don't not to mention um, case. I mean, Sony has money. They could create this stuff, man. Can't they spend more time on 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 some sort of development to make it something more slick, something better? No, they had to waste money on this bulky, ugly, ugly. I mean, one of the ugliest, most hated cases I ever seen. Um, pocket wise it's not even comfortable in your pocket you know it's it's pretty big you know um, it does have a couple things in here that we're gonna talk about first let me open it up so you guys can see some more stuff so this is I hate this you gotta slide it I freaking hate that you break this is very fragile you could break this apart BAM you're done this is why I hate this isn't my <laughs> why I didn't like this one this is like the worst one from all of them and I don't recommend you buying this, to be honest with you, because of this number one thing. And you're not going to like it either. So I'm going to tell you what it is, right? First of all, taking them out, right? It's easy, right? Taking them out easy, all right? And they do have magnets in the bottom, and they do have these copper little setups, you know, and they do have left and right. Now, putting them in, it's it's a it's a bitch. Look at that. you got to spin them around. You know, you're, you're trying to run out, and, and it's, 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 it's hard. It's hard and I'm trying to do it here facing the opposite way right and, and you got to spin it down you got to spin it down to the bottom and then it locks in and then it it doesn't charges until you actually um, see a little light charging in there um, these are supposed to last like seven to uh, eight, uh, ten hours you know um, there were there were not lasting ten hours man I, I had I had problems there were maybe four hours I will say you know and then I had to charge them and they kept beeping and and the audio was way off. The audio sounded like it was Chinese, Japanese. I mean, you were those old classical movies that you had, you know, um, where they put um, audio right behind the vi the the video. So it, 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 I didn't like that. The sync was not there on these suckers. I mean, they were not in here at all. This, the I'm not recommending to buy these. I mean, it's very difficult to put them back in there. Very very hard to take to take them out is easy but very difficult to put them black in place the case itself it's ugly um it does charge with a micro uh, usb of course 
Um, syncing them up, I had no, I had no issue syncing them up. I mean, um, it has an equalizer base unit on the actual application, the phone application that you're supposed to set up here. These things, um, it tells you how much charging you're gonna have. Um, you can mess around. Noise cancellation didn't work. I bought these to go on the plane. I could hear everybody's conversation. There was a little noise cancelling feature. You turn it on and you still could hear things on the background. You're better off buying the balls that cover your whole ears. But I, I really thought these were going to work because they go inside your earbuds to, for noise cancellation. Get your money back. These are not worth it. I mean, I, I'm not happy with them. I, I used them on the airplane. A seven hour flight, right? On <laughs> these suckers. I was very uncomfortable. I mean, if you try to sleep with them, you know you had these bulky things. You could take them off easily or move them to the back and stuff like that. But these were not very comfortable on my ear. I tried different earbuds and stuff like that. Didn't like it. That's why it's the it's not my pick at all. You know, this is like probably the worst one I of all of them. You know that I wouldn't recommend you. It's a Sony earbuds. I mean, <laughs> wireless earbuds. Don't recommend you. Cost is not that bad. You know, it was a uh, hundred bucks. 150 I think somewhere around there I'll put the price in there but don't recommend you buying these at all I mean even though I reviewed them earlier I didn't know how to use them but now I'm using them sync is not there audio sync is not there what else is missing there your song might be ending you're still getting the end on it there's like a, a microsecond delay on them that's why I don't recommend you maybe the Bluetooth is off or something maybe I'm doing something wrong uh, I use them on my phone and I use them on iPad did the same thing <laughs> do not recommend you if you're gonna have that they're good maybe for running and jogging but if other overall they're freaking big there are one big eyesore too like I said putting them back in there this is what I'm talking about putting them back in there there's you can't put them straight down you cannot put them straight down you cannot put them straight down you have to curve them and then you got to slide them in there this is freaking hard, man. If you're on the run, you don't want something like that. The worst. The worst. The worst. The worst. Now, uh, I picked this one, number two. This is the Bose uh, Sports Wireless. Um, these are pretty badass, right? Let me tell you something about that. They're 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 ugly. They're ugly, but they're but they're awesome. I mean, look at that. Just off the bat, tells you how much bat they're charging right now. In the front, you hit the button. It tells you how much it's charging you know it's just one of those things that i love this stuff you know i was like damn but look at the case it is freaking ugly it's the ugliest case another ugly design you know it's not slick it's not slim i mean these also charge for 10 hours you know they pretty they last a long time i i guarantee you they last long these actually sound way 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 better than these right here these are man if you want audio these are really good audio Overall, these three, these are really one of the best audios I have. Um, it also, the, the application that you get, it, it's it's not that bad. You know, it's a cheesy little application. You can mess around with it too on your phone, on your iPad. But the audio is one of the best audios. Uh, the thing I like about it, it's um, sweat proof. I mean, these are for sports, but I'll be honest with you. They're freaking ugly. They're uh, like big eye sorts, you know. Compared to the Sony ones, I'm going to bring the Sony ones too so you guys can see the both of them side by side. All right, just so you can see how big they are. They are almost double the size of them, you know. Uh, but the audio are really good on these. I like a couple of things on it. So let me point out something else on the, on, on the Sony one. Buttons here, you know, to uh, answer phones and stuff like that, to sync up. And, and, and um, that's pretty much what you get on each one. This one. You get much more. You get the syncing button here. You get the plus and the negative on the other side. But the audio quality are a hundred times better than this one. I could actually hear less on this one than this. I should have taken this as a noise cancellation. It's not a noise cancellation, but they sound a lot better. And they block more of the noise too. Even my surroundings, I mean. Um, but like I said, if you're going to get some headsets, some wireless headsets for, for your sound, and you're gonna work out. This is this is pretty cool, but they're they look like one of those big earrings, you know, those big bowl earrings that people wear in their ears. Yeah, that's not pretty much what you're gonna be wearing, you know. Um, they charge pretty simple. I mean, these overall. Let me move these on the, the Sony ones on the side. These, for example, are one of the best ones I like of how they charge. You know, it just you just drop them. You know, you just drop them in here, and they kind of pretty much magnetize. You don't have to do anything fancy. That's it. That's it. It's a drop. 
that's it you don't have to curve them you don't have to do nothing you just drop them and they charge now the case is pretty big because of the battery you know it, it's it's one of those big cases but audio wise it syncs up pretty good i mean i had no issues with any of the stuff that i was watching over the internet or any of the youtubes or any anything like that i didn't have an issue really good with the audio i mean i was very impressed with it i like it that they just magnetize you know they're but they're not my type choice because they're pretty eyesore they're big bulky and this stuff is it's hard to carry around all the time you know um number one in audio i would say you know this would be my choice if you're going to pick up all and you don't mind the the details of being bulky and and so eye swords and stuff and you carrying this stuff then i would say hey buy this one as an audio for audio compared to the sony ones ugly not very good sounds quality is horrible compared to the bose you know bose is made it's, it's the best for our audio man it's one of the best ones for audio out there and, and it syncs up perfectly you know if you're gonna get get something quality this is probably what you want to get now the price is a little bit more expensive than the sony one but it's worth it it is worth it better than what you're gonna this piece of junk uh, this is one of the best ones i like so far because of the audio uh, you have to mess around with the earbuds too also and the, and the hangers that hang on your ear. I don't know what you call them, but I just call them hangers, you know. Uh, overall, they're they're pretty big because they have the odd, the speakers like <sighs> takes all the space, of course. Um, volume controls and all that stuff, it's very simple to set up too. Nothing fancy about them, you know. It's just one of those things that I just get up and go and have fun with it. So it was one of those things. My best choice on audio is this one right now. Now, overall best pick best pick that i pick personally and it's the oldest one is the apple ear ear pods all right these suckers these suckers the design is perfect i mean there's a lot of imitations out there i don't know about getting imitations out there um these are uh, they don't sound the best they don't sound as good as these but overall they're probably my top choices because of the uh, the case and how simple and durable it is like if you open your phone and you and your ipad automatically it knows that you're opening up charging them setting them up um this case is incredible how you set up everything you know just pretty much there's a magnet in there they they fall in place automatically you close it and it charges with your regular phone charger here also too um it it's it, it, you could also change it back here if you, there's a little dot let me see if i could get some light off of it there's a little dot down here, a little button that you go sync it up. Audio sync up is really good uh, with the phone, with the with the movies that you're watching and all that stuff. There's no delays. It, it's it's really decent. Now the only problem is that these earbuds don't fit everybody. You know, some people are, have a little deformation on their ears that you might have an issue. They don't have any different additional earbuds to change out. You know, they fit me perfect. They, they fit me good all right they, they're really good now they do have a little sweat protection on them you know it's something that people are asking me if they, yeah you know you, I, i'll be honest with you i'll tell you it's a true story i washed this thing on the what this on the on, on the clothes uh, on my clothes with my pants i thought they were dead honestly i thought they were dead they were gonna fail <laughs> this thing protected somehow it just it came out and I was like, ah, oh, there goes uh, there goes the earbuds and they came out and I took them out and they turned back on. Now I do like that people when you're gonna talk to them, when you're gonna talk to people on these, these are pretty good. To talk with people, people could hear you pretty good. I mean they kind of go directly to your 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 mouth. They kind of point to your mouth. So now touch wise, there's touch features that you have to do to actually hang up the phone to audio and all that stuff. That's something you have to look as um, look at your manual for that, you know, but overall, the, the audio is not the best audio. If you're going to do audio, the balls are the best ones for audio. Best one overall audio, but the ones I choose were these because they're awesome, compatible, um, easy to carry around, easy for everything access. Um, um, they work with every single Droid, iPhones. I mean, they're compatible too. Like all of these are compatible. All three of these suckers are compatible. Every single system you see is pretty good. But other than the Sony, I will completely exclude the Sony. It's not syncing properly with any audio that I play with. I mean, it's one of those things that I try to sync it up with every audio. It was just not working. It was one of the things I couldn't get it to freaking work properly. So if you're going to buy for 
audio wise music and and, and you want to listen to some good stuff in a good quality i would choose these the both the best ones to choose is this but i didn't pick them the top pick because of the bulkiness and and carrying around this big old case you know and it's a big eyesore you know it's not it's not it's not hidden from view you know people can see this stuff and jogging wise I, I was running i was i was kind of jogging with these well i don't jog i don't run <laughs> jogging with these and they kind of feel like they were gonna fall a little flimsy overall you know best fit was this for me but it's not for everybody you know it's it's one of those earbuds that it might not fit for you uh it fit me perfectly I, like i said that's why i picked them because of the it's it's very small and co compact and i like and i could carry this around everywhere compared to the size of this let me close this case and then this other case so you guys can see the 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 cases side by side see see the comparison look at the size of these suckers this is the only reason I picked this one as one of the best ones because of the case you know the case is one of those things it's been around for longer than these th these two but it, it, the, the design is so simple and um, I wish these two could read off to this one and do something similar to it because um the design of the iPods uh, the airpods are are, are are fabulous I mean they're one of those things that I like this case a lot. That's why I picked the top pick from all of it. But the audio is not the best audio, like I said. I mean, overall, carrying and music and all that stuff, simple. It sounds great like other uh, AirPods, you know, but there's no cushion on it. There's nothing else to cover it. And um, like I said, the simplicity of this case is what won me over from all of these three. Uh, from all these two, actually. But this will be probably like a good choice for you guys to get if you guys want music. If you want du durability and all that stuff, this is really good too, you know. So overall, I mean, it's your choice out there. My pick would be here and here, but not this one. I would completely exclude the Sony out of it. I mean, I'm sorry, Sony, but you guys have to get your shit together, man. You got to get your stuff together. You know, it's one of those things that I've been working hard to find out what is the, what have I been using so far and, and, and testing them out. And honestly, I, I've been testing them all these three. I stopped using this one completely. I'm not happy with it. I was very dissatisfied with this one. I, I, I used it for a month. And um, only for music. No videos, no nothing. For videos, I would use this one and this one. You know, honestly. I've been traveling quite a bit. So I've been moving around. And I and I use these a lot in the plane. Um, when I'm walking around in, in regular stores and everywhere, I mostly take this one. I can answer phone calls, but this one does the same thing too. So, but like I said, this is a nice or it's bigger. It's twice as big as the size of this one, you know, as we see it. Look at, look at the eyesore. This is what you see pretty much uh, the top of it. And this is what you see on the side of it. it. The profiles are much different, you know, if you guys can see. But the technology is much more advanced on the Bose, of course, you know, because of the audio. They're well known for audio. So, it's one of those things that you guys want to check it out and if you guys like what you see i'm your host frank the tank and you've been watching upgrade and if you guys like what you see let me know your comments down there and hit that bell like uh, the bell and let me know what you guys think all right so until next time